Hi Libra, this is a peek at your partner for the week of November the 14th through November the 20th, 2021. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Libra for November the 14th through November the 20th, 2021. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Libra for November the 14th through November the 20th, 2021. Universal energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Libra for November the 14th through November the 20th, 2021. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Libra. Libra, this is a peek at your partner. So, Libra, your partner has the Six of Pentacles. Your partner has the Wheel of Fortune. Your partner has the Hierophants. Your partner has... The King of Cups. And your partner has the Chariots. So, Libra, your partner has the Six of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is balance, equality, reciprocity, equal give and take. This is matching the efforts, energy, time, love, patience, resources, and responsibilities in a relationship. This is balance, but this can also speak to the merchant giving to two, being generous and giving to two. This is also a payout card, a gifting someone card, assisting someone card. So Libra, listen, you know, your partner could tell me that there's something off balance with the giving and receiving. Your partner could be giving something. Your partner could be receiving something here. Your partner could also tell me that someone is giving more somewhere else, giving to two. Clarify the Six of Pentacles for Libra's partner. Clarify the Six of Pentacles for Libra's partner. Clarify the Six of Pentacles for Libra's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is your partner being guarded and standing their ground. They have a stance. They meant what they said. They said what they meant. They're not willing to bend, concede, meet halfway, out of eye, or anything. But this is also a card of your partner saying, you know what? I'm tired. I'm wounded. I'm down for the count. But I still have a little fight in me left. I'm not giving up. Being persistent. But this is also a card of your partner having their walls up, their guards up. They're not trusting. A little suspicious, a little paranoid here. So Libra, listen. Either your partner is kind of guarded because they're receiving something here. Your partner may be a little hesitant on giving something here. You know, they may even be guarding the fact that they receive something because they don't want to share it, okay? However, your partner could tell me that their guard is up because they feel like you may be giving somewhere else, giving to two. Libra, your partner has the Wheel of Fortune. This is divine timing at play. This is the karmic wheel of destiny. This is a faded event. This is change in your partner's luck and fortune. Where this wheel can spin and they can have good luck and fortune. Or this wheel can spin the other way and things can get a little rocky for your partner. So Libra... You know, your partner could tell me that everything has changed here. Your partner could tell me that it's an actual change in their luck and fortune. Or this is about divine timing. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. It is clarified with temperance. 
Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. But the universe is cautioning your partner to be patient, to heal, and to remain balanced. That any decision that they make, it needs to be a careful blending of the head and the heart. Now, when we're dealing with temperance, temperance is about healing, harmony, being willing to compromise, but also reconciliation. So Libra could be dealing with a Sagittarius, but listen, your partner could tell me, hey, I need to heal individually on my own. Your partner could tell me that they're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out and reconcile and change things here, okay? However, it could be something going on with the compromise and negotiations here, okay? And balance here, okay? Something may be off balance here. Also a need for your partner to be patient. Clarify temperance for Libra's partner. Clarify temperance for Libra's partner. Clarify temperance for Libra's partner. It is clarified with the Wheel of Fortune again. Listen, like I said, it can actually be that everything has changed between you guys. Okay, could actually be a change in their luck and fortune. Okay, but also it could be about divine timing and a need to be patient. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Libra's partner. It is clarified with the King of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character, someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go getter, a take charge type of energy, someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their chart. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or your partner is wanting to take action here. Clarify the King of Wands for Libra's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Libra's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Libra's partner. The Emperor could be dealing with an Aries mm -hmm, or a Taurus, but the Emperor is someone who runs empires. This is a boss, a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. This is usually an older gentleman. It doesn't have to be, but someone who's wise yet stern, someone who wants complete control and authority. Could be dealing with this Aries or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the emperor is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child because the emperor is a father figure. Could also be dealing with someone you work with or do business with here. Could also be someone that your partner works with or does business here. Clarify the emperor for Libra's partner. Clarify the emperor for Libra's partner. Clarify the emperor for Libra's partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is someone rushing into your partner or your partner rushing in, demanding truth, demanding clarity, speaking their truth, spewing facts with direct, harsh communication. Now, here's where truth comes out. It's swift, it's bitter, it's harsh, it's direct, it's almost confrontational. It's where you can't get a word in edgewise, but it's truth. So, Libra... Some type of confrontation happening here, okay? Question and answer session. Someone setting the record straight. Someone getting to the bottom of something here, Libra. Hmm. Now, either your partner's trying to be patient here. It's about divine timing, but they're getting a little impatient. And it could actually be over a change in their luck and fortune, okay? Or there's a confrontation happening here because everything has changed between you guys because someone was giving more somewhere else giving to two clarify the knight of swords for libra's partner clarify the knight of swords for libra's partner clarify the knight of swords for libra's partner 
It is clarified with the Four of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. There is the offer on the table that your partner is not accepting nor rejecting. They're contemplating this offer, but actually they're bored with the offer, thinking of missing the offer. But this is also a card of your partner contemplating sending a offer, but they fear that the offer would be rejected. So Libra, listen, now whether or not we're speaking of relationship with you or some type of work or business situation, there is an offer that your partner is wanting to reject. They're suspicious of it. Guard it because they're being shortchanged here. This is what this looks like, okay? Libra, your partner has the Hierophant. Could be dealing with a Taurus. But the Hierophant speaks to the leader of a religious organization. The leader of a metaphysical organization. This is a clergyman, a pastor, a preacher, a teacher, a coach, a mentor, a counselor. Someone of wise counsel. This is the institution of higher learning. This is a corporate institution. This is the marriage card. Could be dealing with a Taurus. But listen, your partner could tell me that you guys have this commitment. Or someone may have commitment on the brain. This can be about forgiveness. This can be dealing with an institution, organization, governmental agency, but this could also be about religious differences or values. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra's partner. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra's partner. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra's partner. Ace of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love. A brand new beginning and a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing. A brand new blessing. A brand new beginning in love. So Libra, listen, you know, it very well could be about forgiveness here and starting new. Could be someone wanting to go into a commitment here and just start new because something went on with you guys. However, this can be dealing with an institution, organization, governmental agency where there's some type of blessing here, of course. But something is off with it, okay? Libra, your partner has the king of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This king is a very loving, kind, compassionate king. He's fair and balanced in his emotions, but he does not wear his emotions on his sleeve. He's in complete control of his emotions. Could be dealing with the Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, or someone with water prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Cups. Now, the King of Cups is someone with a great deal of emotions within them, but they're not outwardly expressing their emotions. They're masking their emotions or wearing a mask. Also with the King of Cups, this is a nurturing father figure, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child here. Clarify the King of Cups for Libra's partner. Clarify the King of Cups for Libra's partner. Clarify the King of Cups. For Libra's partner. Mm, queen of Wands. Aries. Leo or Sag. This queen is a very fiery, feisty, bold, and confident energy. Someone who handles their business with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Wands. Now, the Queen of Wands is someone who's highly motivated, a self-starter, someone who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, or your partner is wanting to take action here. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Libra's partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Libra's partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Libra's partner. Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in their mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So Libra, listen, it seems like this is really bothering your partner, but they're not outwardly expressing it here. And I feel like it's bothering your partner until they take some type of action. I feel like there's some type of confrontation coming down the pike here because it's something that they're highly suspicious of and they're not having it. Like, they're not having it. Libra, your partner has the chariots. 
Could be dealing with a cancer. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. Now, this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently. So, Libra, you could be dealing with a cancer, but your partner is wanting to make some type of move here. Clarify the chariot for Libra's partner. Clarify the chariot for Libra's partner. Clarify the chariot for Libra's partner. It is clarified with the page of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is news or a message about a passionate, creative new endeavor. Now, this can be the news about the spark of a new idea. The news, a message about some type of passionate action that needs to take place. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So passionate messages or news of passion. So Libra, you know, I feel like this is passionate communication here because there's a confrontation taking place here and I feel like your partner is very passionate and anxious about doing so because it's bothering them okay behind closed doors it's bothering them however your partner could also tell me that you know we found passionate messages but I don't know very well could be that someone was giving more somewhere else given to two clarify the page of wands for Libra's partner Clarify the page of wands for Libra's partner. Clarify the page of wands for Libra's partner. Five of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner feeling neglected, abandoned, excluded, left out in the cold. This can speak to financial lack and poverty consciousness. This would be a breakup. Libra, I don't feel like this is about relationships, but I'm going to have to cover it anyway because that's what I deal with. Your partner could tell me that, yes, you guys had this heated discussion or argument, or we found passionate messages and heard the news of you sharing passion with new love, giving somewhere else, giving more to two, and this is the reason why they're making this move to break up. But Libra, I feel like that there's something going on with your partner's finances, some type of financial lack. Something is off balance here. And I feel like it's bothering them until they confront it. I feel like they're going to confront it with some type of passionate communication. They're making this move to do it because it's bothering them too much. Libra, this is a peek at your partner for the week of November the 14th through November the 20th, 2021. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment and share and i'll see you guys next week peace